This is a how-to video that will cover the basics of the analog models of the Q4X laser measurement sensor from Banner Engineering. For this example, we will be using a current-based model with an output of 4 to 20 milliamps, but the voltage-based models follow the same process. We will also be using a Pro Strip Light and an analog to PFM converter to visualize the sensor's output signal. The analog models have two teach methods, two-point teach and one-point teach. The two-point teach method allows you to manually set the high and low values of the output signal by teaching each one to its corresponding distance. The first step is to select the teach mode from the setup mode menu. Press and hold the minus or mode button for two or more seconds. The menu will show TCH. Press the select button to enter the teach selection menu and use the plus and minus buttons to navigate through the options until you see the two point option and press the select button again. The display will flash to confirm your selection and then return you to the main menu. Use the plus and minus buttons again to navigate through the menu until you see end and press the select button again which will return the sensor to run mode. To begin the teach process, press and hold the select or teach button for two or more seconds. The display will show set 4 milliamps. Present the target distance that will pertain to this end of the analog signal and press the select button. The display will then show set 20 milliamps. Present the target distance for this end of the signal and press the select button again. The display will flash to confirm that the taut conditions have been accepted and the sensor will return to run mode. If you need to adjust either point, you can do so with the plus and minus buttons. Press the plus button to initiate the adjustment for the upper limit of the signal and then use the plus and minus buttons to make the adjustments. Press the select button or leave the sensor alone for two seconds to confirm the selection. Press the minus button to initiate the adjustment of the lower limit and then follow the same process. The one-point teach method allows you to teach the sensor to the midpoint of the span, meaning that you will teach the distance corresponding to 12 milliamps or 5 volts, and the full measurement range is set around this point. After selecting one point from the teach mode menu, press and hold the teach button for two or more seconds until the display shows set 12 milliamps. Present the midpoint distance and press the select button to set that distance. The default span of the measurement range is equal to the full range of the sensor, so you will likely have to adjust it manually after teaching the sensor to ensure that you are making use of the full analog signal. For example, a 500mm model will have a default span of 475mm. To dial in the span, begin by pressing the minus button and then use the plus and minus buttons to adjust the span as necessary. If you need to change the slope of the analog signal, you can do so by navigating through the setup mode menu until you see SLPE. Select NEG to reverse the slope of the analog signal. That covers the basics of the analog Q4X configuration. For more information, visit BannerEngineering.com.